Hey everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Um, so some of you may not know, but Google, sorry, Yahoo decided at some point to make life painful for people uh, that use the option team data for automated uh, trading uh, that uh, pretty well scrape uh, off of Yahoo for the option chain data. This is very important info. But uh, if you just go to Apple Options, this is a new format that Yahoo has. Um, so you only get this one expiry. Uh, and then back in the day, you used to be able to get all the dates, all the info in one spot. So as it is currently, it's quite painful to work with. So uh, digging around, uh, lesson learned really is uh, with this, don't rely on Yahoo uh, or Google financial data for, I guess, real live production trading. You gotta use a professional data provider. But uh, when you're on a pretty well zero budget, uh, this is all the resources you have. So thankfully somebody uh, I created a script I put on my blog uh, that resolves a problem. But instead of using Yahoo, we're using uh, Google. So let me just show you what this uh, does. Um, and uh, this was created on, let me just see what the date is. Um, okay, let me just do a map. Uh, uh, Google get options chain data okay so we are looking for this right here come on baby all right so uh this is just came out a few days ago actually uh, april 1st no i don't think it's an april fool's joke because i'm going to show you how it works like i said i posted the um link of this on my blog uh, so let me show you how this works. So essentially, um, would help if I'm in the right, uh, in the right, uh, folder, obviously within, uh, MATLAB here. Okay. So should be able to, there you go. Okay. So this seems to only work on equities. So, uh, I try to find the equivalent of, uh, Yahoo finance option uh, still trying to work that out and see what what, what it is within um, within uh, Google finance but um, it does definitely work with um, the likes of uh, uh, equities so obviously you get all the necessary info as part of the chain um, and see you get an array of structures is fine I mean it's a little painful to work with but uh, that's okay because we got working data here so with that in mind um, that's really useful um, considering that big change that uh, Yahoo decided to uh, go ahead with um, so that is working I'll show you one more example let's we'll do an Apple or something and uh, let me just show you that we can see uh, the size is 1176. Uh, so uh, let me just see what we got here. Uh, yeah, I'm going to just delete all these. Of course, uh, MATLAB decides to have a hissy fit. terminate the video because I'm already showing you the one example uh, yeah here okay let's just see yeah here we go so this is all Apple now um, there you go Apple Oprah whatever um, so things look good there happy days again uh, so I don't have to really worry hopefully for the short term not worry about losing uh, looks like a questionable provider like uh, active tick um, well I mean that's from a set of reviews from a few years ago but for now I'll just stick with this methodology um, 
doesn't cost me anything. But I, like I said, I just want data for testing out know, strategies using option chain data. Hopefully, uh, this script uh, that I just discovered will help you out. Talk to you later.